only on 10 News. Starting with their shots, like tequila, tequila, woo! So they were going at it all day. A party house right in the middle of a neighborhood, and people are tired of the constant noise. 10 News reporter Bree Stefan is live in Ocean Beach, and Bree, they say they've tried everything to get their peace and quiet back. That's right, Kim and Steven. They even put up signs like these to keep people out of their stuff, but it's gotten so bad, the house it got the nickname the Hell House. So it was this cheering and woo, yeah, woo. It was like a rave. Right. It's not typical patio talk. And it's ruining the quality of life of everybody that lives here. Just a few feet away, this vacation rental causing chaos. <laughs> This is cell phone video Delinda Lombardo took of a party bus taking people to and from the house. She's seen dozens of people stay here at once, throwing huge parties, getting very drunk, even hanging off the balcony. If we walk and we say, hey, can you guys keep it down, we get the finger. They'll get 10 or 12 people out there, if you can believe that at night, like I'm talking two and three in the morning. The city cited the owners for renting the house out for less than seven days in a row. I tried going to their apartment, but couldn't get in. No one answered my calls or replied to the message I sent to their account. Delinda has her own message. I, d I crossed out because I don't want people to enjoy their stay and they're not welcome anymore. Now, I just checked, and the listing still advertises a three to four night minimum stay. The city says the owner has until the 1st of July to make all changes, or he could be facing thousands of dollars worth of fines. Reporting live in Ocean Beach, Bree Stefan, 10 News. Thanks, Bree.